Item number SCP-2933 Object Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures Under no circumstances are any individuals permitted to enter SCP-2933-1. Once monthly, a small automated surveillance drone is to enter SCP-2933-1 to assess SCP-2933-A. Description SCP-2933-1 is a partially submerged steel structure within a large saltwater reservoir. The exterior and interior of SCP-2933-1 are very heavily rusted or otherwise decayed, with several features having disintegrated completely and structural deficiencies being widespread. It is currently believed that SCP-2933-1 was designed to contain SCP-2933-A. The interior of SCP-2933-1 is labyrinthian and inconsistent. Passages have been observed as changing, moving, or disappearing completely. The severe destabilization and corrosion of SCP-2933-1 has not appeared to hamper its primary function. Currently, it is believed that all passages within SCP-2933-1 lead to SCP-2933-A, and there is no way to return to the entrance. Any individual or machine that enters SCP-2933-1 will slowly begin to show signs of iron oxide corrosion on their exterior surface. This affliction is believed to be permanent. The corrosion spreads across the entirety of the subject before affecting the subject's inner mechanisms or organs. The speed of this phenomenon increases as the subject grows closer to SCP-2933-A. SCP-2933-A is an unknown humanoid entity located within the lowermost sections of SCP-2933-1. Very little is known about the appearance or nature of SCP-2933-A. Addendum 2933.1 Log Transcript The following audio and video log was gathered by Subject D-13321, who was charged with investigating SCP-2933-1. Alright, can you hear me? Yes, we can. Please proceed into the open entryway. Smells like oil. This isn't safe, is it? Please proceed into the entryway. Fine. D-13321 enters SCP-2933-1 through the primary access point, previously opened by Foundation staff engineers on site. Hardly see for shit in here, it's dark. There's a light on your pack if you need it. Okay. Yeah, I see it now. Walls are metal, floors are graded, also metal. Can you see this? We can. Can you hear anything? Yeah, really faint though. I'm not sure. Hard to pin. D-13321, you don't sound well. Are you alright? You don't feel it? Feel what? There's something bad in here. Can't put a finger on it, but it's there. This sense of foreboding, like it's built into the walls of this place. You haven't expressed any issues on previous assignments. Because on other assignments, I always felt like I'd get myself out of a bad situation. Something is different about this. Acknowledged. Please proceed. D-13321 proceeds down the primary corridor. Communications are hindered by the structure of SCP-2933-1, but D-13321 exhibits no sign of distress. So that thing I said I heard earlier, I think it's metal on metal, like some kind of grinding or scraping. Can you be more specific? Really hard to tell. The echo in here is really bad. It's a continuous sound though, right? Maybe it's just in my head. I don't know. I see. D-13321, our communications are breaking down. I need you to return to the service as soon as possible. Been trying to for a while. Don't think there's a way out of here. Hallways I've marked down start to lead to dead ends. No stairways that go up. Only way to go is down. Skin is starting to fall apart too. It's all rusty, metallic, flakes off when you touch it. Are you alright? Yep, been doing this for a while, boss. Got lucky long enough to make it this far. Figured it would roll around to me eventually. I'll keep the comms and camera online. Thank you. I'm sorry. Not your fault. Just is what it is. Just tell. Extraneous conversation expunged. D-13321 continues to descend. Monitors report rising temperatures as well as high levels of gaseous pollutants in the air. After another hour, D-13321 stops to catch their breath. Command is no longer able to communicate with D-13321, but continues to receive audio from them. God damn it, it's hot. I can hear grinding, too. Somewhere below me. Metal on metal. That sound is getting louder, too, what I said earlier. 
My skin's gone to shit too, rust flakes everywhere, burns really badly, starting to get on my face. I don't think it's metal on metal anymore, there's something else in there too, doesn't sound right. Long passageway now, this room is huge, can barely hear though, it's so loud, that goddamn sound. Oh god. Sound of shuffling. It's a… person. Another voice is picked up on D-13321's microphone. The voice is audible, but noticeably distorted and metallic. H Hello there. I… SCP-2933-A screams. Sorry for all the, uh, commotion. Who are you? Me? My name is Mr. Smiles. SCP-2933-A groans, and a loud metallic sound is picked up. I apologize, it's just, just, just that everything hurts. So much, you know. Yes, Mr. Smiles, right here, on on my leg, see? That says… D-13321 coughs. That says, property of the fact… Ah, hang on. SCP-2933-A scratches at rust on its leg. Camera briefly captures the word, Mr. Scary, property of the factory, printed into the rust before SCP-2933-A exposes the skin underneath it. There we, uh, we go. Th that's much better. Yep, Mr. Smiles, that's me. Camera captures the word, Mr. Smiles from Little Mister by Dr. Wondertainment tattooed on SCP-2933-A's leg. What are you doing down here? What is this place? My father built this for me. He t t told me I. SCP 2933A screams again, and a deep metallic groaning is picked up. Sorry, he told me that it, it, it will keep me safe. Or keep people safe from me. I can't really remember now. Everything t t just hurts, but it's okay. What? My father told me he. Uh. Oh god, I'm sorry. I. Screeching metallic tearing sound. I. I that he would come back for me once he was finished. He needed me for something, and I wanted to to, to be the best son I could be, right? Hang on, hang on. What do you mean, he needed you for something? Needed you for what? <clears throat> yes, see, father was very sick. The rust was inside him, so he promised me that if I took the rust from him, that he would b make smiles for everyone. That was was important. That everyone was was smiling. Wait. So why did he put you down here? After he g g gave me the rust, he well he was afraid. You know, there's something about the rust that really it, it really terrifies him. He didn't even want to, to look at me. That's just fine though. I understand completely. <clears throat> How long ago was this? Oh, uh, a while. I didn't really expect everything to hurt this badly, to tell you the truth, but m my father is out there making smiles right now, and he'll come back for me someday soon, and we'll be together again. Just you wait. SCP-2933-A noticeably grimaces. Uh-huh. Guess you wouldn't know what I could do about this, would you? D-13321 holds up his arm, which is completely covered in iron rust and has several large sections missing. Oh no, n n nothing you can do about that. The pain really only gets worse from there, too. Once you've got the rust inside you, it just spreads and spreads until there's nothing left. Just oil and smoke and rust. Got it. Thanks. <sighs> <coughs> you got any smokes, kid? No, sir. I don't smoke. Don't want to, to do anything to my pearly whites, after all. I am Mr. S <coughs> Smiles. Figures. C can you feel the rust inside you? Yeah, I, I sure can. End log. Communication lost. Addendum 2933.2 Recovered documents. The following document was observed near SCP-2933-A by an automated drone. Wow, you just found yourself your very own little mister. A limited edition collection from Dr. Wondertainment. Find them all and become Mr. Collector. Mr. Chameleon. Mr. Headless, Mr. Laugh, Mr. Forgetful, Mr. Shapy, Mr. Soap, Mr. Hungry, Mr. Brass, Mr. Hot, Miss Sweetie, Mr. Life and Death, Mr. Fish, Mr. Moon, Mr. Red discontinued, Mr. Money, Mr. Lost, Mr. Mad, Mr. Scary, and Mr. Stripes.
Addendum 2933.3 Remote Observation Following a series of failed exploration attempts, a remote drone was directed into SCP-2933-1 to observe SCP-2933-A. The drone maintained communication with command for three hours before failing. The following is an excerpt from the collected audio, edited for maximum clarity. Thank uh... you. 